Hi, my name is Kaya and I'm 13 years old. Um, right now I'm in 8th grade. My passion is about marine biodiversity and everything that goes underwater. I found out that 50% of our corals have already died. And what shocked me the most was that if we kept on going down at this rate, researchers say that we would lose up to 90% of the corals by the end of the century. So I really thought that I should start doing something before, you know, everything goes downhill. I just see the kids, they started to be open-minded. They are so engaged in the learning process and they are so interested in all this learning process. It's amazing to see how they are developing these skills, like how independent they become. It's amazing. It's a magical place, actually. Yeah, for them it's all about adventures and here they are in the world of adventures. They are seeking for the things you would never find in the city. So. And at the same time, as you say, I mean, they are getting uh, the knowledge. So they learn through experiences rather through rule-based learning. So my project is called The Soul of the Ocean. And it's about coral planting, restoration, and conserving our ocean. The first time I heard about coral planting, one of my teachers had mentioned it. So I started digging into it more and learning about it and how it actually worked. I collect these coral fragments that have a chance for survival and replant them, but plant them attached to this fragment that is specifically designed for them to grow on, so that later on they will be able to grow and create a habitat for our whole marine ecosystem. I was not even surprised that she chose this topic because um, she was really interested in this ocean life for a while. She took her bubble maker diving license when she was nine. It's an important uh, life skill. We're not talking now about specific knowledge, we're talking about the way you approach the problem and how you try to find a solution for it. Yeah, well, thank I think you we're the learning ourselves from Kaya maybe because she's bringing this green school thinking to the family. Yeah, so like sometimes ideas. she is telling us that's not the only way to do this or another thing. And so, yeah, we're learning together, I think. Oh, I think green school is the best for this because it really gives a chance for all personalities to grow. Not to follow the rules, but be yourself and grow. To be a bit better than our generation, right? Yeah. Because, um, <laughs> if we look at the nature, we are not at the best situation, so maybe this generation will do we'll something better, something. whatever they can do. The world would be a better place if humanity and our environment would finally clash and go together and live sustainably.